let's take a ride in the Eddie Vader. The Eddie Vader. There could upstairs. be worse things than being trapped in an elevator with Eddie. <laughs> Look, there's even a quilt in the Eddie Vader. Isn't that pretty? Wow, this is cool. It's a total Bernina Eddie Vader. Well, yeah, we got our Bernina flyers up now and uh, open the door and you can see. Oh, wow. Part of art here is my mother's paintings and quilts. So here you see some of my mother's, uh, Diana Leon, the uh, inventor of the store, and uh, she wrote some of the very first books. Here's the Sanford Quilt Book that she wrote way back in 1975 with scissors, because the rotary cutter wasn't invented yet. When that happened, she had to rewrite the book to the Sampler Quilt Book. So here you see the cover is this quilt of this, of this book. So yeah, this is uh, quite a legacy here, started out by my mother. And that book was rewritten into other languages, German and Spanish, you see there. Here's the cover to the original one here. So she yeah. published them and well, authored and, and published the books herself. So Over here we have the attic window. So this is her first attic window book. And then that was rewritten. Here's a new copy of it. You can see the cover here. And my quilt is in the new one. This is one of the quilts, one of my first quilts that I made. That's an attic window. So how long have you been sewing? Mm, probably going on 42 years. Seriously? Well, probably my first one at 12. I can't do my math very good. <laughs> so here you see more of her quilts and her art. My mother was a, a originally watercolor quilter, um, watercolor painter, yeah. and um, foil here. And then you can see her watercolor quilt up there. So there's a sunset of Maui, it's called. And then she did a lot of crazy quilting, which we'll see in another room. This is a crazy quilt. And they, they liked it so much that they made a photograph and calendars of her quilt. And Who then it was went, they? Who made the this calendar? This would be Northcott. Uh, well, this is a company that she published in Germany when she was teaching the Europeans how to quilt. Oh, okay. And so then they made this calendar after some of her quilts. And then it went full circle and they made fabric out of it. So That's here's, awesome. here's the full circle of a crazy quilt right back into fabric again. So cut it in pieces again if you want. So Tell that's, me a little bit about the next one. Oh, the next one is a, looks like a Stratus kind of crazy quilt thing mm -hmm. going on with her color and strip. But she was way ahead of way her over, time. Yeah, that's the strips, huh? You're right, yeah. you're right, you're dead on right because that's the strip quilt thing where she went and stripped and then cut the other way on the strips and then strata sides in there. And, because I quilted one for Alex like that with the strata. Yeah. That had to be She's got metallic about... in there too. There's lamé. Oh yeah, I can see it. And there's some fun stuff in the, in the texture. This one's, you can see all the fun um, pre-motion quilting. She's got her name in the middle. And this is more fabric from Northcott that she designed. I didn't show you down there, but that was all fabric that she designed from Northcott. So this is Flowers of Mainau, which is an island in uh, Switzerland. Mm -hmm. More oils, you can see all of her oils. Here's an original watercolor that she printed on the fabric and she made quilts out of the original. So this is the original and she's made, you know, 20 of these prints like that. Wow. Same with the red So was that there. the predecessor to the panel? Yeah. Uh, you know how they have panels Exactly, you know? ahead of her yeah. time again. Yeah. Yeah, because yeah, she made all these different, you can see these, that's the, another print and the waterfall's another print. Wow. Oh, and then over here, by the way, is our customer stuff here. Fine Hand Quilting, which is one of the first books written about hand quilting that she wrote. There's the original, and that was rewritten. With Cindy. With Cindy, we wrote it with her. And so that's rewritten, and that's displaying some hand quilting in these quilts that are next to it. These are, some of these are hand quilted. If you recognize the name Cindy Walters, it's from Snippets. She was the one who taught that technique where you cut up all kinds of little pieces of um, fabric. Cindy she, and my mom. She's the gorgeous blonde there with equally gorgeous mom. <laughs> Diana Leon. Yeah. And these are hers as well. Yep, yeah, so those are originals. So this is a, a painting. This is the original painting on the cloth, turned into a quilt. That's another crazy quilt that's called uh, Haleakala, which is a mountain in Maui. Maui, sure. Volcano. And We've all are, frozen our butts off up there. Yeah, yeah, you go up two miles straight up. This is uh, part of her uh, sampler quilt books. These are both quilts are called for Gwendolyn, my daughter. These are made for her. 
So you can see all the fun, this is actually hand quilted in there. All that's hand quilted. Wow. I wouldn't be surprised if this is hand pieced also. Look at this, all hand quilted in here. Let's see if I can this get in there like, to show this it. This looks like machine, so it's quite a difference. There's machine oh, quilted yeah. and hand quilted in there. Wow. You can see all the little picking on that applique. Mm -hmm. Wow. So there's all the pieces. And here's the attic window. What has this got to do with Mother Goose? I'll bet you there's a tie-in somehow of Mother Goose with this type of piecing. I don't know what this, this block is called. Mm, I don't either. Nor either that. It was just the, the nursery for the daughter, the granddaughter. Okay, and then in this room. And it goes on and on. In this classroom is... This is crazy. the second classroom. So here's Crazy with Cotton, yet another book by mom. So that's the Crazy with Cotton. Okay. And yes, I'm in here. This is the cover that she pieces. Is, if you go through this, of course, this book's no longer in print, but she goes through all the technique with this cover of how to make this, this quilt. And I was gonna show you over here, there's my quilt that's in this book. So they're, our last name, Leone. And so how old were you when you made that? That one was about probably 92, 93, right when I started with with uh, my mom. Mm -hmm. And so that one uh, I made, and then um, I, uh, you can see everything's all about the lions, right? So everything's, uh, the last name's Leone, so all the trinkets and everything in our family is all about lions. So I collected a bunch of lion fabric and made the crazy quilting technique, same as her where she's taken one piece, stripped it, flipped it, and kind of like a pineapple quilt, gone, gone from outside and then squared it off. And then I quilted down the ditch on all these, and then I free motion quilted around the line so his mane and stuff stuck out. So that's all free motioned and straight line quilted. Every single ditch is quilted as well. Wow. And then this is one that I made. That's, this is just a free form. This is a panel like you're talking about. So this is a panel where that was bought but I quilted all this, and you can kind of see the scale print, which I have free motion quilted out here sure. to match the scale. And then the keystones, which I pieced, I quilted to make it look like that was pieces inside those. And, and the Prairie Point finish is cool, point to too. It, yeah. yeah. To the Another one of Mom's crazy quilts, so this is Cosmo. It looks so modern, though. Yes. Don't you think? Again, she's got the lame in here. It really okay. caught my eye. Yeah. That is, one and the one to the left of it. very striking. And these prints actually in here, these are fabrics that she designed with Northcott. And then this one is another one of hers. This is um, Rhythm of the Saints. So I think she got inspired during a um, Simon, Paul Simon concert. Ah. Rhythm, Rhythm of the Saints was one of his songs. So I think that came out of that. I have another one looks a lot like it, but it's, it's something to do with skiing. It's always called ice and uh, she's got a little skier in the print in the corner, but this is a fun one. But that could be in a contemporary book, Eddie. And look at she's got the Lame again. Yeah. It's all Lame. Another one of the prints. The print here, again, we have the original of this, and see she's made that from those kind of lithograph G clay, you know, where she's she's done the quilting over the top, kind of like a, I call it G clays. What about the one underneath it? This is a customer's or a uh, store sample. Mm -hmm. So that's probably some curves or quilting techniques. So we've got a lot in here as far as like beginning quilting and mm -hmm. advanced quilting, but um, this is mostly my mom's show, except for getting all the books over there. This is great. Uh, Thanks so much for Sarah, walking me for through it. Me Wave bye-bye. <laughs>